Hi, beautiful souls. Today, I'm sharing some stillness from the hedgerows. Often, often we go about our day in a noisy manner. We are always talking. We're always raising our voice to be heard, listening, running about, doing, doing, doing. And looking outside of ourselves for answers, for knowledge. And in our quest for knowledge, we forget, we, we forget to look within. And if we're not looking within, then we lose touch with the truth of who we are. When you are born into this world, you have an inner knowing. You have wisdom within that's very much awake. And what happens is that as you grow up, a lot of it is um, diffused by adults and those that surround you, authority figures. And as this happens, the being, the child, starts to un not trust in themselves. And so what we have to do as we grow up and we become wiser is we have to re-remember the truth of who we really are. And that means to get still and to go within because you may acquire loads of knowledge but that does not make you wise and that does not mean that you know yourself there are many people walking around that lack confidence and seek for answers outside of themselves instead of going within and receiving the sage wisdom from within themselves we've all done it and I'm not saying there's anything wrong in doing it because there's moments in our physical lives where we experience different ways of being, different ways of living. And it is my feeling and my loving uh, invitation that we stop, become still, go within and make this a daily habit, a daily practice and expand our lives from there, expand our place of existence from there. Doing this a little bit longer each day each day a little bit longer, a little bit longer, until that we are living from that space, that loving space, that expansive space. And we enter through the stillness. We enter that beautiful heart portal, the stargate of our heart, through stillness. I mean, you can do this in a noisy place. I'm not talking about that. But I am saying that it needs to be practiced, it needs to be practiced continually on a daily basis until there comes a moment where it's so natural that looking outside of yourself no longer becomes an option unless, of course, it's for the fun of it, the fun and to exchange um, energies with others and say, oh yes, I discovered that too. Isn't that fun? You see, we all have abilities and we're all infinite beings. We're all multidimensional and we can all be anything that we wish for in this now. And when we go 
into the stillness within and to create from that sweet spot <clears throat> and exist from there, then we become all that is. We become all with one. We are one. And there's no separation. And when we know ourselves, then the possibilities are endless. Knowing yourself means to go within, to exist from there, to trust in yourself. And the first step is to just go out into nature, just to stop, to take time, time, to take a moment to meditate, ask questions. The better the question, the better the answer. If your question is too broad, then redefine your question. Keep redefining your questions for your highest self until you retrieve the wisdom that you're looking for. That sweet, clear, clarified wisdom. The wisdom that holds the most amount of light. And the most amount of light comes with great clarification. Great, great clarity. I wish you all a beautiful day. Enter the stillness. Go within and exist. From there, you have the power. You have everything you ever need within you. You are your greatest wisdom. You are your greatest sage. You are a multidimensional being of light. And you can do anything you wish. Bless you. I love you. My name is Zaza. If you like this video, please subscribe, please share, please comment if you feel called to do so. Thank you. Peace.